you you made a comment and I really appreciate this comment. You said the science of cancer knows that it's an injury response, but the clinical management of cancer has not yet figured this out for the most part. Hence, no one is instructing the patient on how to take the food off the gas pedal, for example. So what would you say is the position of most oncologists hearing what we've been discussing today? Um, unfortunately, most of my, my colleagues um, would, would say that it doesn't matter what a patient eats and their focus is how to get the drugs into the patient and they're going to inform the patient of the risk They'll be mindful of the, the to manage the risks as, as the, the treatment goes forward, and they're going to follow whether the cancer grows back or not. So they haven't recognized oftentimes that the person who manifests the cancer has brought a lot on their journey to that place. Oftentimes they are emotionally injured. Um, oftentimes people have decades of emotional stress that they've repressed and they've held and not dealt with. And, it, and the repression causes a blockage. Um, if we look at the energetic mechanisms, the energy of that various you know, energy center is, is, is blocked. Um, and, and energy healers talk about this, and I'm very open to that understanding because it, it, it so resonates in clinical medicine for me. 